up, folks? It's your boy, Hat Free Speaks. We're going to go ahead and jump in today with Muhammad Reza Sajarin, all right? The father of Hamayun Sajarin, all right? Father and son. Father taught the son the, 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 the beauty in music. And I absolutely got lost in Hamayun's voice. It was fantastic. You know, Persian. This is this is the Persian, right? And this is the father. Uh, I believe, unfortunately, rest in peace. The father has passed away. But I want to thank everyone for enjoying my reactions that I have had to his son and other artists here on the channel. And I want to thank everyone for leaving a comment for this gentleman and for me to go check it out. So, folks, if you are new, be sure to bang that subscribe button notification bell give the video a like give it a share because we're going to jump in today with Muhammad Reza Sajarin the song is called Ghulam Chasm and I've pulled up a video that has it in four different languages so we've got English French Arabic and Turkish all right so we're going to dive into the lyrics but fundamentally I, I just want the music to do the talking to me let the music do the talking all right so let's jump in without further ado. It's a first time listen and first time reaction. So folks, I get to share that with you for the first time. All right? Okay, so let's jump in. <laughs> doing with his vocal cords uh, that that right there is, is very hard and technical that is really good i know some of you guys might be thinking hat free speaks this is iranian this is this is the sound of this is normal this is what we this is what we can do but folks that right there listen again listen again you, you gotta respect that straight away that's like that's like mike tyson walking into a ring and knocking somebody out in 20 seconds you just you just know he's got skills right what he's done here is just come in in the first five seconds eight seconds and knock you guys out he's just letting you know the rest of the song is a walk in the park <laughs> چشمیز خون افشاد ز دست اون کمان ابرو جهان بس فتن خواهد دید از آن چشم و از آن ابرو جهان بس فتن خواهد دید از آن کشم و از آن ابرو Wow. Wow. 
Jeez, man. This is, folks, this is like... <sighs> this guy is actually singing poetry. Literally. Li like the lyrics here, I'm reading them as well. I'm listening. I'm like, what? What? I'm hearing something. You know when you're in the desert and you feel like a mirage? Like an, not, is it a mirage? Like an hallucination or something? Something that's you think is there, but it's not really there. That's the vibe I'm getting. And then the, the, the second thing I want to mention, folks, is turning the turning the blind eye to something. Something's happening. Like you see something happening, and then some folks, you know, turn their blind eye, like they they turn away because they don't want to acknowledge it. They don't want to know what's going on. They might be scared of the confrontation or whatever. Uh, you know, there's just this. And there's just something about this. It's, it, it's quite remarkable that he's able to paint this picture with his vocals and, uh, and the, the stuff going on, as well as bringing forth the lyrics in this song. Like I said, he's actually singing poetry. If the lyrics were here, you're probably thinking, what on earth is all this about? How free speaks? I don't know. But listen, you know... The, the eyebrow, the, the the black canopy, all that stuff. You know, what is going on? غلام چشم اون ترکم که در خواب خوشین استی نگارین گلشنش روی استو مشکین سایبان روی ها Was it folks that was it okay that was interesting uh mainly because he talked about a veil and talked about covering uh the eye the eyebrows being en enchanted uh you know so uh, you know in that part of the world folks um there are certain dress codes and cultures people abide by this is this is the way the world is my friends and uh, what this artist has done it seems like he's um paid homage and respected his cultural roots which is fair enough but his voice is fantastic i might explore some more of his music uh slightly probably with a bit more in instruments you know i like worldly instruments there wasn't that much there weren't even any instruments in here there's a lot of singing dd dars and you know all this good stuff and his the reverb on it was fantastic you know what i mean but i'm very intrigued to hear some backing instruments in this you know like i've heard his son do some stuff with some instruments they sound absolutely fantastic uh again fabulous singer 
and what a vocal range what an absolutely fantastic vocal range he has you know so yeah that was it that was from a different part of the world but it's all good that was <laughs> that was quite the experience folks so yeah there we go all right thank you so much make sure you are staying safe and i'll catch you on the next one peace <laughs>